What's up guys, I by Yourself here. Welcome back to the channel. Today Apple released iOS 14.2 to everyone worldwide. And now today Apple released a lot of software for newer and older devices. In this video, we're gonna go over some of the latest details and a new software available for your iPhones, your iPads, HomePods, Apple Watch, etc. So first up, Apple released 14.2 to everyone worldwide. So if you have an iPhone or an iPad that supports iOS 14, you can now update to 14.2. This has been released again to everyone worldwide. And now I have a final review on the release candidate in the links in the description, which is the exact same one as Apple released today. So you can find out all of the new features by clicking in the video in the description down below where I have my final review on 14.2. Now, aside from 14.2, Apple also released today watchOS 7.1. A new watchOS is well. I'm going to have a full review on 7.1 here in just a couple of days on the channel, so make sure to stay tuned for that. Aside from watchOS 7.1, HomePod software update 14.2 is now available as well. This one brings the intercom feature to your iOS device alongside iPad, Apple Watch, etc. So now what it is available right there, it is the new intercom feature, which I did cover on my 14.2 coverage as well now aside from new software believe it or not apple today also released old software for older devices that do not support ios 13 or 14 so ios 12.4.2 is now available to be downloaded on older devices if you have an older device that does not run iOS 13 or iOS 14. Now this update brings quite a bit of improvements to the security of your older iOS device and also improvements to the FaceTime capabilities across the device. So newer devices and older devices were having slight issues with FaceTime. This also brings slight improvements to that department as well. Now some of the new features on 14.2 include the new emoji, the new music platter in the control center. There's just so much to talk about. Again, everything will be linked in the description. New AirPlay uh, settings and options here that we can find. New menus for AirPlay are now available here as well. As you can see here, redesign UI for the AirPlay menus in AirDrop as well. We also have a few new wallpapers. Again, guys, links will be in the description for the entire breakdown for iOS 14.2. You do not want to miss all the new features that are available now for you to download for your iPhone and with iPad OS 14 as well. So major, major day today for Apple. Just letting you guys know, 14.2, everyone can download it right now, as well as for your iPads and the watchOS 7.1, which I highly recommend, although I will be having a full review, as I mentioned, with everything that's new on watchOS 7.1. There you guys have it. Thank you for watching this quick update, and I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.